Hello everyone and welcome back to Forager, where I have been busy at work, doing very little work actually, letting the game just uh, do its own thing, gather some materials. We haven't passed too much time to be honest off camera, but I have got a lot of money because I sold a lot of things. So I was thinking, what better way to use that money than to buy stuff, uh, namely land. So let's have a look at what we can buy. Honestly, this is probably one of the bigger things that we're going to be doing for the next little while. Uh, in this series. Ooh, wait a second. We can afford a new biome. It must be done. Uh, who are you? And what do you do? Uh, let's get down there. No, thank you. Uh, sure, we'll bridge the gap a little bit. In fact, quite a lot. Hello, what be down here? Ah, Scallywag. I was talking with an NPC. How dare. Uh, oh, Demon Lavender? Uh, okay, we, we're getting quite close to lamp. Yeah, the huge rock of all of it, my lord. I agree. Uh, let's grab a little bit of everything, actually, while we're here. Right, hello, you. Hey there, I'm an engineer. You can tell I'm smart and pretentious because I told you what my job is, even though you never asked. Oh, okay. Anyway, since I'm better than you, go fetch me a few materials for my factory. Please. Uh, really? <laughs> ah, you make me laugh. All right, uh, let's go. <laughs> I guess I am going to do it, but... Uh, wow, well, actually, we can make quite a lot. Go ahead and make me 10 Royal Steels, please, and thank you. Uh, we've got all the Royal Steel within the, there. We need plastic, though. Uh, we can, however, make this. Well, I see no reason not to. Uh, actually, I see quite a lot of reasons not to, but I'm going to ignore them all. Uh, right, let's get rid of you, and then hopefully sell a bunch of stuff. Uh, they're worth a reasonable amount. Uh, I could sell some of that, but I'm not going to. Uh, we've got an awful lot of poop, an uh, awful lot of bones, we've got demon horns that we could sell. I think for the most part, though, we're not going to. Uh, should we make some leather? We definitely should, yes. Uh, we should possibly start expanding in this, maybe soon. And we definitely need a lot more bottles. All of the bottles that we can get, we need. I wouldn't mind yet another vault, though, if I could have one. And I could. There's really no reason not to. I could have one down here, and I could have ooh, a series of vaults. Oh, that sounds like a marvellous idea to me. Uh, we're going to store some things in there that I don't particularly want to get rid of. Um, I could put poop in there, actually, as well. Um... Also, the berries. Sure, we'll pop the berries in there too. And the seaweed. Uh, the slime, maybe not so. Um, oh, there we go. Let's have a look at you. 100% more resources. Oh, this is grand. Truly. Now, in the uh, area of effect of our lighthouse, that's probably going to be even more amazing. Uh, let's see. We should probably have a look to pop down some more lighthouses and see what we can do with that. But for the time being, things seem to be okay. Hello. There we go. Oh, look at all that slime. Marvellous. Oh, oh, sorry. Sorry, chicken. I was completely an accident, I assure you. Uh, do we... Oh, I don't really think we need anything from these anymore. Uh, what we do want, though, are lots and lots of fruit salads. Always with the fruit salads. Forever. No, 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 no. Go away. Thank you. No, thank... Oh, my lord, there's quite a lot of uh, the skeletons over there. Sure, okay. My goodness, we need a lighthouse over here so badly. There is so much stuff to gather. My goodness. All right, so another skill. Yes, please. And obviously, we know what we're going for. We're going for prospecting, straight up. Donk. And now with that, we've got geology. All rocks drop. Well. I'd say that's slightly better than this one, frankly. Uh, mining, rocks drop 40% more minerals. Um, I think we're going to be going with geology and then mining. My goodness, that was worth it. Ye gat. Uh, where would we want to pop a lighthouse? Probably somewhere over there, I'm thinking. Would be a particularly nice place to drop one. Let's grab the U as well. Uh, we'll take that too. Uh, I don't think there's really anything more we want to gather from over here, but we can... Sure, let's, let's fill out the area. If nothing else, it means that we're going to be gathering more materials with our mining world. So that's a big yes from me. 
There we go. That is a very, very nicely filled out little little zone. I approve of it enormously. Uh, let's go ahead and start gathering items. Though we should probably pop some fish traps over here in this cold biome. That's something I hadn't considered yet. Actually, pretty good idea too, if I do say so myself. Uh, I'm using my energy up so ridiculously fast. Let's uh, gobble down a couple of bits of food. There we go. All of the materials, all the time, then I've got to just collect them all. That's a little bit annoying, but oh well, I'm sure I'll live. There we go, let's grab everything. It's a shame that it isn't some automatic way to capture uh, butterflies, but I guess uh, we're just going to have to put up with that one. Uh, right, so, fish traps. I should have left a, a couple of gaps, I guess, but... Um, would this be in that zone or not? I can't tell. Uh, I'll actually... I'm, you know what? I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. We're going to get a little bit more money. Then in the next area, I'm not going to fill everything in. I will pop down some fish traps around there. Just to see if we gather anything. Though I noticed we've really not gotten anything new from the... Uh, from the desert biome. So, I'm not really sure where that's going. Ooh. Yes, please. I approve. Uh, is there anything else? Uh, I guess we could just sell a load of that slime. Honestly, there's a load of things we don't need anymore. Uh, drop that off. Uh, the pumpkins, for example. Uh, I would like a few pumpkins. Just five. And uh, we'll keep five in there. Actually, should we be... Uh, you know what? Let's go for ten. Ten of anything that I want to keep. That seems reasonable. And then we'll sell the rest. Because, again, we don't particularly need... Uh, all of the... Uh, what on earth was that? What just... Something made a very large... Growl. There's something down here, perhaps? Hello! How dare? Ooh, wait a second! Haha! -ha! So that is... Ooh, there are two of them. In fact, there are cinder blooms as well. Okay, so this is a good area to drop a mining rock, for obvious reasons. Uh, oh my lord, this takes a long time. Mine through, though. Thank you. Uh, let's grab all of that. I will drop down some fish traps over here, though. Uh, I can drop one. Well, that's not exactly amazing, but okay. Uh, let's head on up. Uh, what are we dropping in here? We can drop a little bit of everything, frankly, but... Uh, no, it's fine. One, two... Oh, actually, no, of course. This is going to gather all of the items whenever it's uh, dropped, so... Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter. Uh, all right, well, let's go ahead and just sell all of these for now. There we go. That is plenty of cash there for now. Uh, let's see. Can we make more rolls? So we need the steel at this point. Oh, actually, we need the gold ingots, my lord. All right, make 368 gold, please. Don't you even dare, you scallywag. My goodness. Right, I need a lot of milk. This, uh, I'm going to be as gentle as I can be while also being really fast. I can't actually be that fast, it seems. I'm so sorry. I am... I feel bad. Note that I'm not stopping, though. Which really means that... Do I really feel bad enough? No. No, I don't feel nearly bad enough. I need to feel a lot worse. Uh, right. Hey, you... Oh, <laughs> why? Bloody skeletons! How dare you do that? How dare you make me do that? Oh, that's it. All I was i was feeling bad about how I was just wiping you out all the time, but no, no longer. You scoundrels. Ah, oh, my lord. Ah, but truly, it's me who's the real scoundrel. Well, that is that has ruined my mood. My lord. Let's get a few more uh, landfills in there. Ah, that was quite distressing. Dodge 10 attacks. Ha, I like that. Uh, okay, well, this, honestly, you're doing the right thing, staying up here. Sheeps, everywhere else is dangerous and wretched. Wretchedly dangerous. My goodness. All uh, right, at least we can get rid of most of that. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, bottles of oil. Okay, we'll store that for now, because I have no idea where I'm going to use it for. Uh, let's go ahead and drop off the milk at the very least. So, there we go. We need another six and only six. That's actually pretty cool, but we're also going to need a key. So let's preempt that by getting one now. Sure, and then 
as many bottles as I can get. 16 will do. Uh, no, be gone. Right, with that done, go hither, thank you. Uh, I've no idea where I'm going to find the egg there, though, which is a little bit of a potch, but uh, for the time being, I guess that's what it is. Uh, we could possibly buy some land around here. We can, yes. You know what? Sure, let's get some more land. We have got some strange obelisk. Let's pop down a bridge or two. Right. Let's have a look at you. What are you? Some moon and what looks like some sort of... Is it a shrine? No. It looks a little bit like the, the gathering shrine, but... Uh, we'll have to have a look into this. So we've got two puzzles so far. Uh, I'm guessing that I need to use a ballista or something and shoot that in the eye. It, it's way too close to too many uh, Zelda-like puzzles for it not to be there. And we've seen how much uh, inspiration has been taken from puzzles from Zelda. So I'm, I'm going to guess... Oh, we might even need a bow, actually, thinking about it. Uh, you, though... Well, actually, you've got a sword behind it, so can I... No. Okay. Uh, unless that moon has something to do with it as well. Uh, it could be magic. Uh, or it could literally just be... Because there is a day-night cycle, so it could just be that it's wanting me to do something at night instead. But we'll have to come back and have a look at that one, I'm afraid. Uh, see if these have ever caught anything interesting. No, nothing particularly interesting there. Alas. Well, that's fine for now, I guess. Right. You be gone. Uh, also you. Thank you. Uh, very good timing on that fairy, there. Nope. No, 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 no. Thank you. No, 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 no. I'm curious what effect fire has on a demon. Considering, you know, he was born in this stuff. That's fine. Right, let's have a quick chat. Thank you for the materials. You're welcome. This is complicated work, so you probably wouldn't understand it, but factories need steel to make cool things. Here's your reward. Ah! Okay, wasn't actually expecting a chest. Uh, okay. What do we got? More fish. I'm starting to wonder if people are pulling my leg. Really, I am. Can I use this? Oh, I can. Plastic fiberglass electronics and obliterator. Needs 100 electronics, 100 fiber, and 100 great skulls. How much are electronics? Crystals, plastic, royal steel. Oh, wow. That's expensive. Royal clothing for fiberglass. Plastic requires bottled oil and coal. Well, uh, sure. Make me some plastic. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay. Nice and easy. Uh, right, we need another two of you. It's going to probably take us a little while, because everything around here is expensive to get. So, we might be waiting on that one for a bit, unfortunately. But for the time being, it's not too bad. Ouch. You scoundrel. Okay, I'll have your cooked meats, thanks. Uh, is the market selling anything useful? I'm kind of tempted to build another market, so I'll have uh, two... Places I could buy things from. Oh, I can just buy keys. Liquid luck. Tempted. If I had the money for it, I would totally go for that right now. Alas, money's not really that easy to come by. Um, that being said, now I do. Hooray! We'll see what that does in a moment when we've got some more resources. Okay, I think we've got enough EXP at the moment. You'll notice that I've moved all of the... Uh, the fish traps along a little bit just because I was finding that we didn't really need that many. We're not really using fish as a food source anymore. We're collecting a quite a large amount of other odds and sods besides. Right, let's uh, get you out of the way. That is, of course, to say that we are carrying plenty of seaweed as is. And we are dropping a few more fish traps uh, around the place. Now, oh, we only get one? Uh, that's fine. I will accept one. Right, we have got enough items to make a few new things. And I'm actually incredibly, incredibly eager for those. Uh, let's use the liquid luck, though, first. And what has that done? Lucky. Resources drop double items. Increased chance of finding rare items. Oh, well, that's, uh, that sounds particularly good. Let's start uh, making use of this, then. Let's uh, gobble down some of this and see if we can't get more. Oh, my lord, the amount that we're going to be getting right now. This is going to be stupid. Look at the amount of sand and coal that we're gathering. This is truly fantastic. I'm hopeful that this also counts for items that are creating stuff, so uh, like factories and all that. Because if so, 
then we probably just got double amounts of plastic from that one. We'll have a look at that in a second. That's fine. There we go. Got a little bit of a, an energy boost as well. Excellent. Oh my lord. Digging is so good. So ridiculously good. Right, okay. So, with the items that we have, uh, we can go ahead... Uh, I need a key, so go ahead and make me another one. Uh, right. We can get the Druid Sword. We can get the Crystal Pickaxe. The Royal Shovel. We'll need a fair bit for the Demon Animal. Um, we only need Royal Steel for this one. Well, let's get the Sword for now. Go ahead and get me the Sword. Uh, I do need more Royal Steel, though, as a result. As a direct result, of that, actually. So let's get more Steel on the go as well. And then we'll get Royal Steel soon after. And that will allow us to make the next item. There we go. Let's just grab a little bit of everything. There we go. How long is that going to take? Eh, it's going to take long enough. Actually, I know, I know. There is a lot of sense in going for the shovel first, considering I'm still using that while I'm uh, while I'm wandering around. But I want the sword more. I'm not going to try and frame it as anything other than it is. Uh, let's go ahead and dig these up. I think I can put them in a, be a bit of a better position. I kind of like the idea of having them in uh, two by twos. Uh, for reasons that I couldn't really explain. Honestly, I just do like it. So that's the way we're going to be setting this up. Just in the, the, the middle of an area, if we can. Because that seems like it'll be a little bit more useful for us. There we go. There we are. There we go. We got a new sword. Deals 150% more damage to enemies. Slain enemies drop herbs. Oh, okay. That's a bit of interest. Oh, it's night time. Let's go and test our theory. Is this the way it's going to work? Yes, it is. Oh, fantastic. Wait, can I just keep getting this? Oh, that would be silly if it was the case. No, no. I'm now hungry as well. Uh, very well. Let's use these spirit orbs. I would like more energy and more health, actually. Yeah, I think we'll go with more health. There we go. Not bad at all. Thinking about it. Uh, can we build a new... No, we're ways off that one for now, but uh, that's fine. Let's go ahead and grab a new skill then. Now... Down here, Geology, all rocks drop chrome. I think this is an obvious one. Especially because it's going to unlock two potential new parts for us. So there we go. We've got uh, Deposit, unlock quarries. No, no idea what that is. And Hunting unlocks bows, arrows unlocks cooked meat. Oh, actually, you know what? We need to have a look at what I need for a ballista. I hadn't considered that one yet. Let's have a quick gander. Who would that be? Ballista. I need 15 arrows. Uh, so... Actually, you know, if I wasn't constantly selling all the arrows I was digging up, then I'd probably have that. Kind of. That's kind of annoying, but well, I guess that is what it is. Oh, my Lord. Look at all of the resources coming in. This is fantastic. I can barely see what I'm doing because of the amount of resources. I'm so wealthy, I'm blind. Wait. Um, that doesn't sound like a good thing, actually. Uh, in, in retrospect, I think that was, that was actually a bad trade-off. Uh, right, let's see what we can grab. More arrows, fantastic. I guess you wouldn't need to unlock the ability to make arrows then, if you can just gather enough from digging. All right, well, I'm, I'm, I'm game for that one. Uh, I would like the more steel though, if I could get it. Also, a fairy, please, and thank you. Uh, let's grab you. We've got enough to get some more plastic, I believe, at this point, but we should probably avoid going for that. Going all in on that one. There we are. Get the royal steel, and then we can get the shovel soon after. All right, let's uh, grab these fairies as well while we're wandering around nearby. Uh, right. Well, I need another key now, unfortunately. So, ah, damn it. Need iron then. Uh, 272 should keep us going for a while. In fact, we're getting to the point now where I need another furnace. My lord, I wasn't really expecting that one, I'll be honest with you. Uh, but okay, I mean, we can we can make this happen. Uh, let's also fill this area out, because we've got so many things that are mining over here. That it makes sense to try and maximize how useful they're going to be. Uh, and as the light dragon filter, uh, I'm tempted. I'm going to confess, I'm actually quite... Ooh, got a sunken ark. Where did we get that from? No idea, but that's good, I think. Uh, let's get rid of all these. So, we're going to go and hand in the sunken ark, which we've got a few of, actually. Oh, this this uh, multiple drops is awesome. There we go. There's still a lot that we're going to have to collect, though. But while we're here, sure, let's go ahead and drop in the last six milk. What? Complete the museum farming bundle. I have no idea what that is. Ah, really? I haven't got a key yet. 
Damn it. I was hoping that it had already been crafted by the time I got here. Okay, let's have a look. Where's the key? Oh, that's right. We couldn't make it because I didn't have enough iron. There's an adept. That's fine. Let's uh, grab a little bit of everything. Are you dropping herbs? I'm not seeing the herbs dropping. I, oh, maybe I am. Maybe I am. Oh! I almost forgot what I was doing there. You gads. Uh, goodness gracious me. Uh, let's avoid that in the future, please. Uh, also, let's grab some of you. Uh, ouch. How dare. Let's go and take care of you. There we are. That is an awful lot of coal that we're about to get. I approve. But let's go and hand in, uh, rather, stock up a couple more bottles. I think that's what we're going to need here. Let's get 27 more bottles. How about you? Yes! Let's get that on the go. Ah, fantastic! We're finally upgrading our gear again. It's been a long bloody time since the last time we were able to do that. Uh, too long, if you ask me. We could go for royal clothing and then make master boots. Hmm. Tempting, actually. How much royal clothing can I make? I can make 14. Uh... Okay, go ahead and make me 14. That will no doubt be useful in so many ways that it's worth just having an abundance of it maybe. Wow, no. 360 is more than enough, thank you. My goodness. It's getting, getting to kind of silly numbers now. But I am unfortunately lacking uh, money. So we are going to need to start producing more cash. As a rather... Oh my lord. So many butterflies. Butterflies and sheeps. This is the best part of my all of my lands. The, this part is my favorite. Uh, let's go ahead and make some more fruit salad, though, while we're here. Another 85. I'm not going to say no. Uh, there we are. And so close. So very close. I want to see how... I guess it's going to be much like the other shovel upgrades in that it's going to just give an extra row and column. And let's have a look. We've got the royal shovel. Digging always... Oars? Wow. Oh my goodness. I, I'm not why, sure why the shovel is getting so much preferential treatment, but it is fast becoming the most awesome tool in my entire arsenal. The humble shovel, everyone. Not nearly as humble as it would like you to believe. My goodness. I am very taken with this uh, tournament of events. I approve. We are going to have redonkulous amounts of resources very, very soon. Or at the very least, well, yeah, because we're getting all of the, if we're getting everything we need to make all the way up through steel. Not royal steel, though. We're not getting gems. So I, I guess that's that's the limiting factor there. But uh, still, it's kind of ridiculous. Thank you. All right, what about the rest of the items? Robotic shovel. We need, wow, a lot. And bottled death moths? Okay, so these are called death moths. Uh, only need four plastic to get the the crystal item there. We need two royal steel and two royal clothing. I think we're going to be going for the crystal sword. I think that's a definite. Okay, so can we get more royal steel then? Uh, we can. Only three though. But we're making... Yeah, we actually are going to need a lot more gems, it seems. All right. Well, that's going to be our focus then, I guess. Uh, it's going to have to go out, really. Scallywag. Lollaby. Uh, that's going to have to be our focus for a little bit, getting there. My lord. These skeletons don't stand a chance. It, this is bullying, frankly. My goodness. Uh, let's see what else we can get, though. We've got a couple of items hanging around. We're about ready to get the next shrine uh, upgrade turned back on again. Uh, let's go out the sword, take care of you. No. Oh, <laughs> why? <laughs> this is a the problem with power. We've got so much now. Too much power. We're becoming careless with with the way that we wield it. This is a this is a commentary on humanity right here, my lord. Uh, but it's okay. It hurts. It hurts a lot. But as long as as long as the Beat family are still there, and still think I'm I'm worthy, you're amazing. We love it. It's okay. Everything is all right. Even though my instincts are telling me that everything is wrong, and that this world is now cursed, the Beat family still believe in me, and that's all I need. For now. We'll see how long that lasts. Uh, we've got 14 arrows. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Let's go and see about building a ballista. I think that would be a good idea. Uh, oh, I, I now need 15. Well, thank you for changing the rules and, uh, under my feet, game. My lord. Uh, it's okay. We've got enough 
energy to just keep doing this forever. So we'll eventually have more arrows, I guess. Uh, oh, hello. Hello, I wasn't aware that you could leave your area because you hadn't done it so up to now. But uh, all right. Let's take care of you then. Far away from the family. Thank you. Uh, any more of your friends down here? No. Good. Uh, hmm. I need to gather you, though. Uh, right. Uh, sure, actually. Let's uh, dig around here, see what we can get. Anything good? Uh, no, not really. Just lots of ores. But that, I mean, that is good, I suppose, when you think about it. But still, looking for arrows right now. More than anything else, I just want arrows. My lord. I think digging is going to quickly become the main way that I gather resources. Everything else seems ineffectual by comparison. I... I well, this is what happens in, in incremental games. You start out, everything takes a long time to do, and then suddenly... Yeah, the, the numbers are, are having to be co counted in the quadrillions. Uh, stay away from the sheep. Thank you. I appreciate your cooperation. Uh, right. Uh, no, I don't need to kill you, so I'm not going to. Can I get any more? No. <laughs> well, it was worth a try, damn it. Uh, okay, so, in terms of the next areas that we can expand into... Hmm, I'm going to have to have a good think about this one. Also, I need a lot more iron. Uh, let's see, where's the next one I can buy? Oh, that seems to be the very edge. Okay, well, it makes sense then to go for this one, which is stupidly expensive. Is that... Oh, no, it's only 2,000. I thought it was 24,000 or something. Uh, all right. Well, let's have a look then. Let's sell a little bit of uh, everything we don't need. We don't need these anymore. Um, don't need these. We're gathering them at stupid rates. Uh, get rid of all that. We got a lot of brick. Hmm. I think that's fine, but we do now have enough. Let's get another key on the go. Because we are going to have a second bundle to complete. That's actually pretty... Pretty good uh, progress, if you ask me. Uh, right, we are definitely going to need more uh, of these. Or some way to speed them up. There may be something. Because we haven't played around with magic at all. Uh, or shrines. And people have told me the shrines are probably worth me looking into. Uh, spirit crystal. Mm, no. No, not for now. Uh, we've got all the royal steel I need there. Need two more royal steel here if I want that. Could I possibly make that anytime soon? Not anytime soon because I've got all my furnaces working. So, time for another furnace, I guess. I could have one over here. I could build one up there, perhaps. Start doubling them up. Or even just add some more down here at this point. That wouldn't be necessarily a terrible idea. Um, but I don't really want to build too close to the, the family. So, we'll go ahead and we'll build over here. Uh, five. Let's go for four instead. That'll do. Right. Now, with that done, let's go and complete two separate... Or rather, get two chests. There we go. Thank you very much. And... What do we get for this one? Master Trapper. Some butterfly wings. And another spirit orb. Everything is spirit orbs now. Uh, I'm... It's a little bit less interesting than I was hoping for, but, uh, okay. Let's keep... Uh, my energy and heart roughly equal. There we go. So, what are we looking for over here? We are looking for the flowers. We may actually have enough of one of them to pop in there. In terms of mining, um, oh, sure. Actually, that was very easy to do. Uh, we may actually be able to do quite a lot of things in there. Uh, but it looks like I'm going to need to start making my own scrolls. I mean, I could just buy them, I suppose, but I think making... Oh, yes, please. Take all those nitrates. Making the scrolls makes more sense. Uh, let's drop these off. There we go. We're actually doing quite well there. Uh, drop off the royal cloth in there as well. Uh, actually, no. The royal cloth should go over here. Royal cloth there, along with... Iron ingots. There we are. And the iron ore can go in there. There we go. Nice and tidy-ish. Tidy-ish. Uh, that's the best we're going to have for, for now, I think. But can we upgrade the sword? Not yet. Still waiting on that. But that'll, that'll take a little while. Okay, well, with that done, let's activate the foraging shrine once again. Let's grab a little bit of everything over here. 
Ah, so we are actually getting plants. Plants count as herbs. Well, that is rather amazing. Oh my goodness. Oh my uh, but that is quite amazing that we're getting all types of flowers now. So any, any kind of plant seems to count, which I'm okay with. Let's have a look down here. Anything to slay? Yes, quite a few things actually, or rather one thing, I suppose, is different to quite a few. It's fine. Uh, technicality. Let's grab you. We probably want to go and grab a lot of oil next. Do we have any on me? I do. Sure, we'll get a bit of plastic there. <sighs> I need a mining rod for this area. So badly. My goodness. Uh, but it's okay for now. Uh, grab you as well. There we go. Okay, that's uh, a little bit better. So far, it seems that the only place I'm getting gems though is from mining ores. So that is going to be the uh, the focus there. That's uh, that's the way it's going to balance itself out, I guess. Right, let's sell all of this. Don't need any of it for now. Uh, we'll go and start you making more oil for us. Excellent. And gather up a little bit extra down here as well. There we go. Right, now then, do we have enough? Yes, let's get the new sword. Ah, oh, this is good times. Got 2.3k. Um, sure, we should be able to... Oh no, just a little bit shy. Let's wait for that so that we can pop a mining rod down right in that corner. And it should actually, over time, pay off because I imagine it'll uh, end up covering the other island, the 1,700 uh, island that we can gather as well. See what we get. Oh, plenty of gems. Oh, okay, I take it back. We can get gems through digging. Well, that is uh, a bit of an interesting one, honestly. Very well, I'm, I'm not going to turn my nose up at it. There we go. So it is actually starting to feel like, yeah, well, it's definitely getting gems while digging. Why is digging so overpowered? Why is there any other tool than a shovel? Is, is this some sort of statement? Is the developer trying to say something? I think they might be. Uh, I mean, you know, digging is cathartic. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, when I was when I was tending the allot my family's allotments when I was younger, I, I used to enjoy uh, turning the ground. Then I shoved a garden fork through my foot, and I enjoyed it a lot less from that point on. But up until then, I was quite keen on doing all the shoveling and hoeing and, uh, and garden forking. Deals 200% more damage to enemies. This sword can attack. What even is the pick? Why have I got a pick? What point does it serve at this point? Oh my goodness, that could, because that attacks multiple things. Oh wait, that attacks multiple, oh wait. Hmm, okay. This is an interesting development, I must say. Uh, I approve, I think. I think I approve. I'm not entirely sure. I sort of feel that I'm losing out somehow. The, 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 something has been lost with this, but at the same time, it is- Oh no! This hubris, I'm being punished! I've also got uh, an arrow, so uh, guess who else is gonna be punished? You scoundrels. There, we'll have a ballista right in the middle. Oh dear, that's actually very long range. How long do those go out for? Also, do they automatically collect it? They don't, actually. Hmm. That's a bit of a shame, but okay. Oh well, let's uh, flesh this area out since we've now got a, a ballista over here guarding it. Um, there's no real reason not to uh, to have skeletons spawning everywhere. Let's get all of this built out. There we go. Perfect. And let's get that up down here as well. I'm going to actually make the hole there this way. And then start filling out over here. Oh. Marvellous. We are making lots of different areas that uh, they can get across, though, which is not exactly the best. I swear, if that ballista kills any sheep. Well, honestly, that would be the game just teaching me a lesson, really. But let's be quite quite uh, realistic about that. But that's uh, not too bad. Maybe getting one down by the demon area would be a good move as well. Let's see. Uh, fiberglass. Ooh. Yes. Let's get the master boots. Uh, crystal pick up. Why would I even want you? Right, fiberglass electronics. Okay, electronics is becoming a big part of everything now. I'm gonna need a lot of those moths. Hmm. All right. Well, have I got many things I can sell right now? Probably. Let's go ahead and sell a 
bunch of these. And go ahead and drop off the steel in there. There we go. I would like... Yes. 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 Yeah, I'm just going to straight up sell those. There's no reason not to. No. Nope. You're gone. There we go. Right, so let's get rid of all of these for a rather tidy profit, I would hope. There we are. Own 10 lands on 5,000 coins. We've got 5,000 coins. My goodness. Uh, fairly happy with this, I must say. Um, okay. My Master Boots. Move speed increased by 60%, gives a 20% chance to dodge attack. Well, that's just quite useful. Uh, we'll also pop the, the uh, paper down there as well. Alright, let's have a look. Uh, next boots. The robotic boots. Fiberglass and electronics. Okay. So, everything is kind of moving in that direction. Ooh, we just need some leather. Very well, I'll take those gloves. Uh, I kind of do want to get the crystal pickaxe, but at the same time, it's like, why? Why even bother? Uh, right, let's get frankly stupid amounts of glass. Let's not get that much glass. We'll be here forever. Um, steel? Sure, we could get more, but honestly, I think we need more iron ore. We've got two making iron, two making gold, one still making loads of bricks. Uh, we could sell some of those, actually, uh, if we particularly wanted to. Uh, I'm not sure I do right now, but we've got a lot of stuff flowing through. Right, no, to you. There we go. Uh, right then, let's have a look down here. There we are, next level up. Can I just bat my way through these? I can. That was just fantastic. Alright, let's go and have a look then. Next up. Hunting is something we can go for. Um, mining, looting, deposits, or alchemy and novice scrolls. We get our own factories. I'm not sure really that matters right now though. Unlocks bows, arrows, and cooked meat. Oh, well, I've already got that, so I don't really need it. Um, what's a deposit, though? I'm tempted. Let's find out. Gonk. That unlocks Calcivorous. Allows you to eat minerals and gems. Why would I do that? I can't think of a good reason why I would want to eat my gems. They're probably one of the only things that it's hard for me to gather right now. So I'm going to say a big fat nope on that one. Also, be gone, foul demon. Lord. Uh, right. Um, Lord, so many angry beefs. Granted, I have been uh, forcing many of your kin to basically eat poop until they pooped. Thinking along those lines, yeah, I can see why they're so angry with me all the time. Right, so what have we got? In the snurdry, no, farming, quarry. Uh, uses a lot of my, all of my topaz, actually. Um, Sure. Will, will this will this auto mine? Because if this auto mines, I am okay with it. Does this generate? Can I interact with it at all? What? What? Okay. Few things are obvious to me from this. One, it just generates ores, so it's great in combination with a mining rod. But two, it generates the ores. Not around itself, but in the area that it's in. So, I could have another one just south of it, and I'd fill this one up as well. Okay, so they're better used in areas which are largely um, empty. Oh, you know, and you know where which areas are largely empty, because I do. Uh, do I have many mining rods up there? I don't know. But, let's go north. <laughs> uh, actually, I think it would be kind of funny to build one of these... Oh, I'm going to need more topaz. Okay. Well, having one of those around this miner here would probably be pretty awesome. Uh, I, I don't know. It would be thematically appropriate in my mind. Right. How's everything going down here? Oh, reasonably well. Uh, okay. That's not too bad. And we've got five, 5k. So let's go ahead and plonk the two areas down over here. And I'm going to get another mining rod, I think. So, buying land. Yes. Oh, it goes even higher. Okay. And yes. What? Okay, so I think I'm going to need two more items. Let's go ahead and grab those two more items. Uh, two more keys, please. Oh, wait. I probably need a bow for the... Oh, yes, yes. Uh, I should get the bow the next chance I get because that will probably satisfy whatever quest I have with that uh, eye statue. 
Yes, thinking about that is probably wise. Uh, sure, we'll get metal gloves. I approve. And we're going to need a bit more royal steel and a bit more plastic to get you. Can we get any royal steel? Not much. I can get one. Uh, can I get more plastic? Hopefully, yes. Can I get more plastic? Yes, six. Okay, begin. Fantastic. Uh, how often does that happen? Do I need to attack it or something? I don't know. But at the very least, let's go and check out these new areas. There you go. Let's grab you. And I'm afraid I'm going to have to build a bridge. So let's go ahead and do that. Build a little while. There is secrets where flowers don't live. Okay. Attack speed increased by 40%. Well, that is quite useful, considering I'm now able to ga gather redonkulous amounts of resources. Okay. Well, I'm okay. I'm actually pretty good with this. Not just okay. Uh, let's grab all of that. And where they don't live. Now, that looks suspiciously like an area for a chest. So I'm not even going to worry about that one. But let's go up and see... Right, we've got plants on these sides where plants don't live. Ah! Okay. I was wrong, uh, apparently. Of course, yeah, that was the only corner where there were no plants. Uh, very well. I had another spirit door. Why am I not at all surprised by this? Uh, okay. Well, I will accept and I will increase my hearts one more level. And also, is this just going to be a straight up combat challenge over here? It might be. Destroy 100 grey stones. Pillage it. I, I didn't destroy them. Okay, that was seemed remarkably easy, and they dropped. Oh, 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 oh! Ouch! Ouch! No, bad. Naughty, bad. Please be frozen. And you also. Oh, being able to freeze your enemies. Wow, makes everything so much easier. And also being able to sword rocks makes things easy too. I don't have the spirit orb. Why am I not even slightly surprised? Ah, uh, oh well. Uh, let's grab everything. That, uh, everything about putting the uh, quarry uh, somewhere where there was already a lot of free land, not necessarily required because I can make free land when you think about it. Right, now, where would be the best place for you to go? Probably around here somewhere, I'm going to say. And this one down there, let me just have a quick look. Where is the other mining? Right, okay, just for this. So we do actually want one out in this corner, unfortunately. Um, to cover this whole area. Sure, I can pop it here. That should do good enough, I would say. That'll be plenty good for me for now. Right, but on that note, I think we're going to be wrapping up today's episode. We've actually got a lot done. We've upgraded our, our equipment several times. And uh, again, this is par for the course for incremental games. It's slow to start, but once you actually get uh, get the ball rolling, it can be crazy, crazy good. And you'll just find that uh, later on, it's, it's just going to be ridiculous. We're going to be rolling in resources. But, uh, you know, the other side of incremental games is everything is going to start costing astronomical amounts. So it's still balanced in a way, just... Uh, with this game, it seems there are certain synergies that just work ridiculously well. Uh, so it's maybe uh, maybe one of those games that doesn't mind you just ending up in a position where you're hopelessly overpowered. Because let's be honest, it is actually quite nice to be ridiculously godlike and, and have all of the things every now and then. It's good to struggle and it makes the victories that much sweeter. But sometimes it's just nice to be, be ridiculous. So with that, I'm going to wrap things up here. So thank you very much for joining me, and I hope you're going to be joining me for the next. But until then, and as always, remember to upgrade your shovel. Take care, everyone.